bless you. This is our call to worship. We would like to welcome everybody online for tuning in to this beautiful service as we worship the Lord this morning. We're so happy to see all of your beautiful faces. Y'all looking good this morning. Gentlemen, you're looking great. Let us, let us get ready now to go to God in Christ and to pray and to love on him, to lift him up and to thank him for the miracle that he did this morning. I'm waiting to come back Starting at the first verse. Right. 
Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for allowing us to wake up this morning and come to worship you once again for another Sunday. We thank you for we thank you for the traveling grace that you have provided for us, allowing us to be here safely. Lord, we thank you for putting shelves over our head, clothes on our back, and food on the table for us. We ask that you please. We, we know that we are all probably short for the glory of God. We ask that you please forgive us the sins that we have done. And just be there with us, Lord. We ask that you please to see the blessings of all the things that you do for us, Lord. Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen.
Yeah. <laughs> so then we find that 
appeared and did what? Went back to Israel. And they called not all things dead. Jesus asked them that point, said, Y'all have any meat? They said, No. He said, Well, cast the dead on the right side. Yeah. He knows where the preachers are. And if you do what he said do, you get what you're looking for. Right. Cast it on the right side. Yeah. And they caught so many fishes until they couldn't, one person couldn't put them down. He had jumped out of the boat, ran up to Jesus after John said, well, he, but he hoped to put it the net on up out of the water with the fish. And look how many fish they had. Just from a few minutes with the net in the water. They died all night and caught nothing. Because they had left doing what Jesus told them to do. And whenever you don't do it his way, you always will wind up in nothing. And do it his way. He's able to support your things when you're doing it his way. Amen. Amen. So we find that Peter here had made several errors. Although he was a disciple, chosen one of the Lord, but he made a few mistakes. So now, in the latter part of this scripture, Jesus speaks to him again. Peter, seeing him, said to Jesus, Lord, what shall this man do? That's how Jesus told him. What he wanted him to do. In verse 20, Jesus said, uh, Then Peter turned about, seeing the disciple whom Jesus loved, following, which also leaned on his breast and supper, and said, Lord, which is he that betrayed me? And the Lord told him. Now, when Peter saw him, after Peter told him what to do, he saw what? John. And he turned and said to him, what is he, what is he, he don't told me what to do, he told me my future. How it's going to end up. But what about John? Yeah, yeah, right. How many times you say, you see people in the church sometimes, they are doing what they supposed to do, you wonder about what you're doing. <laughs> Why you not doing what they do? What would it try to be like if everybody was a people? What would it be like if everyone was a mother? But so many times, people are still doing what they supposed to do. They don't know what you do. Or not doing. Who may not can do what they are doing? Huh? Many members were what? One body. You don't want your hands going with your feet going to do. <laughs> but I've seen some people get that man, took that piece of dead and said, they learned how to do it. Now you, you know, if you want to do it because they can do it, yeah, you do what you can do. That's what matters. Doing what the Lord has in you to do. He has blessed you to do. If you do it, do it well, you'll be pleased. Amen? Amen. So then, when Peter looked at John and Jesus hadn't told him anything, he wanted to know. He wanted to know the Lord. What shall this man do? Jesus said unto him, If I will that he tarry till I come, what is that to be? Follow thou me. Amen. Amen. Other words, what is it to you? What He's going to do. You do your job. I told you what to do. Huh? Now you want to know what John's going to do. That's the way that I told him. You just do what I told you to do. And you think about it. Whatever in the middle of the church does, he's the whole part. The way goes away. Amen. Everybody couldn't take your other shirt. And somebody needs to hold somebody. Everybody can't be 
one thing. Yeah. But it takes men yeah. to make up the body. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Now you, you know, you can't play the organ. Same with the organ. Did he do it? Yes. 
Yes, he loved his enemies. Yeah. Even though that persecuted him, he could have killed him. But he didn't. Yeah. Think about it, somebody beating you and you can kill him and you stay to eat. He said, I can't do that. Oh, yeah, you can do it. <laughs> he did it. I said, he did it. Yeah. You can do it too. Yeah. You just have to love him yeah. and then you can love others. Yeah. Amen. Yeah, you can do it. If he said it, he took it. It wasn't easy. Yeah. You think about a crown over your head with thorns in it. Put it down on your body. You could have just looked at him there still day. You know when they came to arrest him? He asked them who they were looking for. They told him, he got everything. What happened? They fell back. They fell back. They couldn't get it. He got up again. He said, I am. He said, take me. Let the others go. You know what he said? Yeah. Let them go. Yeah. If you're looking for me, yeah. Yeah, take me. And let my disciples go. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Now, you think about it. Uh, you're having the power that he had. And then you give yourself over to him. Let him arrest you. And rip you. Spit on him. Yeah. Mock him. Do all kinds of things. You see? And so many times people say, well, I can't take all of that. Oh, I wouldn't take it. Maybe you won't take all of it, but you can't take it. Right. Yeah, if you have enough love yeah. in your heart, the love yeah. of Jesus. Yeah. Amen. Because when we act like the Word, yeah. we can't bring the Word to Him. Right. Yeah. Right. When the Word is cussing and fighting going on, yeah. you can't do it in the church. Yeah. I am the church. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. What we call, you know, we say church, but really, <laughs> The church house is not the church. I say it's not the church. Huh? And it's those of us who come in here and go out of here. We are the church. And then when we can be the church in our neighborhood, amen, somebody will go to the church with us. Somebody will go to the church house because they see what we're doing. Yeah. Now even the person that's going wrong, they know what's right. They know right when they see it. Yeah. So when they see the light yeah. and they're in the dark, yeah. they don't want to come out of the dark into the light. Yeah. Amen? That's what Jesus said. So let your light so shine yeah. that men may see your good works. Yeah. That's what he said, didn't he? Yeah. 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 yeah, let them see your good works. Yeah. Then they will glorify the Father who is in heaven. Yeah. But when they see our good works, yeah. not our bad works, yeah. amen? Yeah. You see, if if me and my wife is fighting all in the, uh, uh, in the neighborhood all, all night and everything, <laughs> acting up, you can't get nobody else to follow you. <laughs> they got to see some Christ in you. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. They don't want to follow you. But yeah. huh? yeah. well, they I can do bad by myself. <laughs> have to look for no good. You just, you know, <laughs> do what you're supposed to do the right way. And the man is looking for a wife, he finds yeah. 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 you find it. Yeah. And if, if you're looking for a wife, amen, you'll find it. Yeah. If you're looking for one, yeah. amen, you'll know when you see it. Yeah. Huh? yeah, you'll know when you see it. So then we got to do what? Do what Jesus said to us. Yes. Right? Yes. Amen. If we do that, yes. we'll find things to be much better. Yes. And we'll keep our eyes on him. Yes. Not on Jim, but on him. Yes. Yeah. Eyes on him. Yes, yeah. Find what others may say or do. Yes. Don't let them take your eyes off of the Lord. Yes. Keep the eyes on him. Yes. Because yeah. he is the way. Yeah. I said he is the way. Yeah. Do you know he is the way? Yeah. The truth and the light. Yeah. Amen. Amen. If you follow him, yeah. you're not going to worry about anything. Yeah. 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 He's bread to be hungry. Yeah. I said he's bread to be hungry. Yeah. Water in dry places. Yeah. He's a shelter in the time of the storm. Yeah. You don't have to worry about it, just follow him. Yes. Follow him. Yes. We may get dark sometimes, but keep on following. Yes. 
Yeah. He'll bring you to the light. Yeah. Follow him. Yeah. I said, follow him. Follow Amen. Amen. Yeah. I made up my mind a long time ago. Yeah. I'm going to follow the Lord. Yeah. You get your mind made up. Satan will try to turn you around. Yeah. Yeah. I say, he'll try to turn you around. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But keep the eyes on him. Yeah. I say, keep the eyes on him. Yeah. Amen. Amen. He will lead you. Yeah. I say, he'll lead you. Yeah. The right way. Yeah. He'll lead you from earth to glory. Yeah. Keep the eyes on him. Yeah, yeah keep the eyes on him. Don't let nobody. Yeah. Just the brother. No friend, Jesus, who followed him. Follow him. I said, follow him. He's coming back out. He's coming back out. Yeah. We ain't got, we, he tell us to go there. Some people say, I'm trying to go to heaven, but I'm not. I don't know the But I know the one who knows me. Thank you. 